This is what you call really, and I mean really, not wanting to go to work. He sawed his foot off so he wouldn't have to go. Now, why? There are so many things you could do. Be thankful for your job in these times. He's 56, threw his foot in an oven, hobbled to his garage, and called an ambulance. Doctors unable to reattach the foot, so I guess that's a permanent not going to work kind of thing. Man, that is desperation. He needs to go to the psychologist or something. What's the craziest excuse you've used or heard for somebody getting out of work? An, a guy recently <laughs> saws his foot off. That's just about top it. Hey, listen, you know, Roger just got back off vacation. You know, now he's trying to come up with more excuses to go back on vacation. <laughs> That's why he's doing this one, okay? Roger, I'm glad you made it back from vacation safely. Buddy. Uh, thank you very much. I sawed my tongue off. Thank you. <laughs> See, he went up to you there. <laughs> there you go. That's right. Y'all have a good day, guys. Y'all be safe. You too. Thanks for calling. Hey, 97 Country. I didn't get out of, out of a whole day with this one, but I actually did get out of a half a day. You ever heard the kids excuse the dog ate my homework? Oh, yeah. Well, I had a dog that ate my truck key. <laughs> yeah, right. That's the problem. The dog loved chicken. Loved it to death. I actually went in on my way in from work one day. I turned around and bought some chicken. And I left, I, you know, I had one too many to drink and, and left the, the bag, the empty bag with the chicken bones and everything in it. Well, I moved the, uh, the keys about fell off the end table, so I moved them over to the side. The closest thing I could figure is I said that ch- chicken smell on my hand. And he, when he started eating, he didn't pay attention to what was what. He just ate. <laughs> and wow. they, and, and it took, well, I had to get a guy out to make a key and everything, so I, I didn't get started from work till around lunchtime. Ah, uh, just be patient. It'll come out the other end. It did. It did. You know, I was like, thanks, thanks a lot. You know, I, I was glad he passed it because I didn't want nothing to happen to him. Sure. But, you know, it's Safety a little thing. late now. I already had to pay for a new key in Locksmith. Well, now you can't use that excuse anymore, can you, Buzzy? Uh, I don't burn that one all up. <laughs> You know, he could have gotten a full day off if he'd just said, boss, i got to wait for the key to pass and then prove it. You know, if the boss wanted him to prove it, he could come in with the key before cleaning. Boy, I've, I've heard of people getting those hide-a-key things, but that's just <laughs> ridiculous. <laughs>